The Bernardo Circus is in town, bringing incredible acts to Madison. But as Gabriela Becerra shares, there's one thing that this circus does not have. Gabby? The Venardo Circus tent can be seen from the Beltline, and they have everything you would expect to see inside, from cotton candy to acrobatic performers. But what you won't find are elephants and any exotic animals at this circus. Inside the red and white striped tent, and underneath the lights. A long time ago, I actually dreamed that I would meet you here. Ringmaster Kevin Venardos brings that dream to life. All I had was a dream, not a plan or a scheme. A dream to create his own American circus. But there's one thing that separates his circus from most others. I believe you can make an amazing circus that happens to have no animals. A circus with no animals and built around a performance. This is just sort of the style of circus that I love, that I wanted to do. I love the singing and dancing, I love the storytelling, and uh, the fact that we didn't have any animals uh, was in the first measure not a political statement. Venardos previously worked alongside animals in the Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Circus. He says the difference between the shows are simply one has animals and the other doesn't. There are two camps of for and against. Even some of my own peers in the circus industry uh, think that I'm turning my back on the circus when I couldn't disagree more. And instead of a big arena, the tent is smaller, making the show more of an experience. The intimacy here is, in fact, one of the things that people talk about the most. I love being so close to the aerialist or those amazing acrobats. Literally, the people who are checking you in here, taking your ticket or ushering you to your seat, they're the performers in the show. Madison attendees would agree with that. I really feel like I'm having like an experience with them. I can feel like they can like hear me. So that's kind of awesome to see them like just so close. Bernardo says he is proud his circus isn't afraid to be different. I personally believe that this is the future of the American circus. And I want to be a part of the future of the American Circus. Venardo Circus will be in the West Town Mall parking lot until September 2nd, so Manistonians still have a chance to check it out. All right, looks like fun. Thank you so much, Gabby. Mm -hmm.